Hey guys, I'm Kirko. Welcome to Beyond a Steel Sky. This is a groundbreaking 3D adventure thriller set in an AI-driven future. So where in the world hack the systems and solve dark conspiracies to uncover the devastating truth. What a description on Steam, boys. What a description. I am so excited to play this. I have not played a proper adventure game in a long time. Uh, we have a 3D adventure game coming out in 2020. That's a genre that nobody almost nobody makes anymore and I'm really excited to play this. It's being developed and published by Revolution Software and released on Steam yesterday. So on the 16th and I'm playing it today. I I gotta say I'm really excited to play this. The devs were nice enough to send me a key to test it out and we're gonna start a new game. I play for like 15 minutes just to see how things work. I skipped the cutscenes so I don't get spoiled too much and we get to go and experience all of that together. Because I think we have something really, really cool ahead I'd of us. I already decided it was going to be my last night in Max's village. I was sorry to be leaving, but I was restless again. Beware! The day grows dark, and demons stalk the gap by night. Harsh old woman, stop your superstitious nonsense. Besides, this is the best time of day for fishing, eh, hey, Marlo? Yes, Dad. Look, Foster, I use these broken sensors to make a fish alarm. It detects the fish before it bites. Nice work, Milo. Milo was just like me as a boy, and the tech skills I'd taught him would help the village after I left. Do you really have to go, Foster? How can we ever pay you back for all you've done? It's been my pleasure, Max. One of Anita's pies will be payment enough. I owed the Gap folk so much. My first tribe fostered me when I was orphaned all those years ago. They taught me how to recycle tech scavenged from city dumps. Soon, I even built myself a playmate. <laughs> Joey and I were always together. As I grew, I upgraded him. He became the best friend I ever had. But then... Foster! Foster, wake up! The sensors detect a fish! It's a big one! What the...? It was no fish. Max, keep back! Marlo! Dad! What are they? Max! Drop him, you... Milo had gone. The machine, too. But its riders had left something behind. Max? Milo? What's happened, Foster? Where's my son? Max? Max? Oh, no! I told them. I told them there were demons stalking the dark. The stalker that attacked us was a machine, not a demon. Please, Foster, I don't understand. What... what happened? I told Anita everything I could, though I knew very little. Max was barely conscious. I could only hope that with Anita's loving care, he would recover. As for me, I had to follow Milo and his captors immediately. I'll bring Milo home, Anita. I promise. Thank you, Foster. I know you will. Dawn was breaking as I left the village. The featureless wastes of the gap stretched away from me. Night followed day, then day dawned once more. Time lost meaning as the tracks beckoned me ever forward. Determination had long replaced sadness. Whatever it took, I would find Milo. The tracks were barely visible now, blurred by the wind. But I was sure I'd reach their destination soon. Then I saw the thing I feared the most approaching. 
sandstorm. I battled forward, but now could only guess that my direction was correct. I decided to save my energy and sank into an exhausted sleep. Maybe the old woman was right. Maybe demons did stalk the gap. For as it shrieked and thundered around me, the storm brought back my nightmare once more. Union City security was attacking. As my tribe screamed in terror, I salvaged Joey's motherboard. Taken captive, I couldn't save my village. But I survived when the security copter crashed, entering Union City. On the run, I soon got Joey working. Upgraded yet again, he helped me overthrow the evil that ran the city. As I left, I told him to make the citizens happy. Union City was no place for me. I wanted to be where I could do most good, helping the scattered people of the Gap. I woke to find the storm had passed. But not without finishing its cruel work. The tracks were gone. I was lost, and so, I feared, was Milo. Then, I heard them. Gang-gang birds. Scavengers. And in this wasteland, that meant only one thing. People. And so, the story begins. What an intro. I love that. I really loved it. And now we get to see how the game actually looks. It's not so cartoony as you might think. Despair it is cartoony, to but not so much. I was sure that if I could find where the stalker had gone, I would find Milo. Then, in the distance, I saw a girl crouching over a body. It feels that it has a bit of that Borderlands cartoony-ish look, but otherwise really looks cool. I like it. I like it a lot. So this is going to introduce us to how to run and all that stuff and what we can do. And you guys are going to get to see that there is a lot of cutscenes made with in-game graphics as well. Hey, excuse me. Who the hell are you? I'm searching for a vehicle that... Ah, no! They stole, they stole her thingy. <laughs> I just Oh you Whatever screwed up, Foster. Was, you screwed the up. Bird had it now. Yep, the bird had it now. And the birds had the corpse as well. Oh no, whatever can we do? So you can see we can interact with everything that has this reticule. You just need to get close enough and that's how it's gonna be done. You know, classic adventure stuff. But this one, you know, being 3D and all, it just looks awesome. There's better ways to interact with the world because you can just go around and explore yourself and also there's a lot of cutscenes so let's examine the body propped against a rock we cannot get to it because the gang gangs are around so we're gonna have to gang examine gang them were eyeing up the corpse hungrily and since I've done this before I know that I have to throw them a pie and then they'll get away from here it's great but this is pretty much as far as I've played, I've I've not wanted to spoil anything for myself. I didn't I didn't I didn't watch that cutscene we just watched. So the girl had been doing something. That's only for me. Hand. I wondered what. He'd clearly been dead for days. It looks like it, yeah. He does not look good at all. The Ooh. logo. I'd seen it before. On the androids that had taken Milo. But were they androids? Because this guy has the same lead. outfit, but I he's no android, right? Let's go find the girl. But first, let me take a selfie. Union City. I was back. Welcome back then, buddy. So I guess we get to go into this beautiful big old city. I like that. Sounds pretty cool. It's very cinematic. This game is very cinematic. I really do like it. 
Uh, I don't know if it's a, the greatest game to play on YouTube, just because of the sake of be, being adventure game. I'd heard rumors of how but, the city had thrived since I left Joey in charge. But just playing on your own? I finally going to see for myself. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Now he left his robot body in charge, but he says that the city has, you know, thrived. But I don't think it's really thriving. <laughs> that was unfortunate. Not thriving at all. I don't know. Maybe they just don't like anybody coming in. You know, maybe they just hate the fact that people out there are, I don't know, doing whatever. Out! Now, I don't know if this is just the city of androids or if there's humans too. Welcome, I'm not quite sure. Gaplander. Welcome. Well, hi. And you are? Community Welfare Droid 2 see you at your service. At your cervix. Registration. Please make your way to the immigration terminal. That's All right. Okay. I'm not here to register. I'm or maybe for... not. If you're looking for the immigration terminal, it's right over there. Thank you. There was a girl over there. You see her walking around? Let's talk. Let's ask him about the I'm looking stuff. For a vehicle that maybe came this way. A vehicle. Well, this is a freight entrance. Okay, so we're in the right spot. So good. You're good. In the right place. Nice. Right. I need to find a boy called Milo. He was... What you need to find is the immigration terminal. It's right over there. Fine. We'll go for the registration. How do I register? Easy. Just go to the immigration terminal and you'll get a U-chip for your temporary ID. Noted. The correct route is indicated by these signs. Alright. Sounds easy. Sounds easy. It is. Thank you. Without it, you won't be able to interact with any of the Minos devices in this area. That's fine. I'm gonna Not do that know. right now. Pleasure. Pleasure was all mine. How can I be of assistance? Shut up. That's how, what you can do. So I saw the girl. I think it was the same girl that we saw in the desert out there. Now, looks like there is one of these signs. Hello? Holographic sign? Oh, it's pointing this way. The sign was directing me towards immigration. Okay, so let's go towards immigration then. Strange bench? It was a tire or modern art. I couldn't tell which. Okay. I think his friend Joey has made this city way more AI than he would ever want. I wondered if the citizens minded being electronically tagged with these U-chips. I'm sure they were just happy about it. Okay, now where is this immigration thing? Still pointing this way, okay. Is this is this it? Hand device? Examine. I guess this was the immigration terminal. Alright, well, good. Let's use it. Welcome to the Union City Registration Terminal. Please place your hand below to receive your U chip implant. Smile for the camera. U chip implant successful. You are now registered. Do you get it in the glove? The U chip had been implanted into the palm of my hand. Alright. I wasn't sure how it was going to help me. Me neither, but I'm sure we're gonna learn soon. Not to get in here then, I guess. Alright, there's a dude over there, let's go talk to him. Hello gang gangs, how's it going? Ministry of Comfort, help us keep the city free of vermin. Alright, that sounds like a good idea. Safety services? Help desk. Oh, maybe they know something about Milo. Hello lady. Uh, let's examine. I'm sure a young woman in uniform. Uh, talk. Sorry to keep you waiting, sir. Welcome to Union City. No worries, I like your uniform, my lady. My name is Greta. It is my duty and pleasure to answer any questions you may have about Union City and the local area. I don't know about the pleasure, but sure. Today? Uh, so there's a missing kid. The child has been kidnapped from my village. From your village? Yes. Was the child a registered citizen? Oh, so city? that's how it's gonna be, huh? No, his name is Milo, and all right, all right. Polite apology. Minos could only concern itself with registered citizens. Oh man. Uh, I was hoping you'd be able to help. Oh man. Is hope a wonderful thing. In the oh, meantime, oh, shut do you up. have any other <laughs> queries? Uh, I guess we can ask about the stalker. I'm looking for a vehicle. Has anything come through here? No. You haven't seen a weird vehicle with legs instead of wheels? Polite apology. I cannot discuss the details of other visitors' vehicular movements. 
But this it seems vehicle, legit, yes. They kidnapped a child. But the child wasn't Is registered, so, you know, you nobody cares. We can ask about Joey, I guess. So Joey's still running things around here? He was, until just a few years ago. Oh, no. That doesn't sound good. Hope he didn't screw things up. Not at all, sir. Joey the Savior Joey was a the great Savior. leader. <laughs> Citizen happiness reached unprecedented levels. Nice, good to know. Good to hear it. I happen to be an old friend of his. Oh, we're all friends of Joey, sir. Gone, but not forgotten. All right, so nice Joey day. is gone. In gonna... Union City, sir, there is no other kind of day. I'm sure. I'm sure that's the way. Okay, let's let's talk to this man over here. What's his issue? Looks like he's trying to fix this. Can we jump down there? Probably not. Hello, technician. He was a scruffy looking technician. Scruffy is a good word. Why is he all green? Excuse me. Oh, hello, visitor. What's up, dude? Ballard. Maybe I can help. <laughs> you? Sure. Hey, listen, Mr. Gaplander. It's totally cute that you want to help. So he's a douchebag, huh? He's a teeny bit more advanced than what you used to. You'd be surprised. <laughs> I'm pretty handy with these sorts of things. I don't know how he can Sorry, take it. Got to get back to this bollard. It ain't gonna fix itself. Oh, dude. I don't know how he can take people talking to him like this, but I'm sure we can fix it. Jammed. Maybe we need to find something. Maybe we have any. We have a crowbar. Maybe we can use a crowbar. This, by the way, looks like a dick. Let's use the crowbar. All right, he's using it. So might actually do it, dude. Get out of here. Oh, we did! Yeah, piece of cake. We did! Dude, Don't cake talk about cake. Everything is a cake day. these days. Do you know how many times I've scanned this thing? The last scan must have done the trick. Oh, you see, so you're very, diagnostician. You're very smart, aren't you? Very smart. What can I do for you? Uh, a missing kid, hey, maybe? Have you by any chance seen a kid come through here? Where's the little dude headed? On an adventure, is he? Oh, my God. Oh, no. He was kidnapped, Adventure. snatched from his village, and brought this way. Oh, right. Uh, nope. I, I haven't seen anything like that. Sorry. Mm, you yeah, sure, buddy? You don't mind, I've got to get back to work. You sure? You seem awful... Awfully concerned with your work suddenly, Mr. Hobbsworth. Mm, I'll, keep, I'll keep an eye on you, Work's dude. Bridge controls. The bridge seemed to be operated by some sort of hand scanner. Well, we do have a hand scanner. Can we do it? Can we? Error. Insufficient uh. permission. Okay, this so we need to get Hobbs Ward or somebody to open it for us, probably. What is what is this monstrosity over here? It's a vending machine? Straight from Eat. Ugh. Enjoy this little piece of happiness. Spankles can. All right, I'll the take that. Injected a garish, be clown can of soda, labeled Spankles. I don't want to know. Terminal. You are currently at your maximum allotted Spankles so, allowance. Have a ooh, nice day. Connecting to Minos. All right. Welcome to Minos. Temporary ID. So we need to fix this. Personal data. We have nothing over here. Okay. Mm, we are C plus. All right. We have Ministry of Aspiration, helping you strive every day in every way. Caring for you deeply, mind and body, Mr. Wellbeing. Ministry of Safety, protecting you from cradle to grave. Ministry of Comfort, smoothing away life's sharp edges before you even know they're there. And Ministry of Consumption, giving what you want when you want it. What is this Gandal over here? That's the Civic Guide, okay. History? Huh. I don't know exactly what this means, but okay. Alright, let's exit this. So there's a trash bin. There's Joey! Hello, Joey. It was a statue of my friend Joey. Yeah, my I friend Joey. I couldn't imagine why they would have erected it. Yeah. If Milo had been taken this way, I was sure Joey would help me find him. Yeah, but I needed Joey to has find left. someone around here who'd seen the stalker. There was a strange smell, and it was coming from the truck. Oh, yeah. Truck doors. Those birds weren't going to let me... Okay, we do not have pies anymore. We need to scare them away to get in here. Oh, okay. Okay, there's a dude over there. Let's go talk to this guy as well. 
Maybe you can get into his truck? Probably not. Hello, Mr. Trucker. The guy looked like he'd been out in the sun a bit too long. Smelled like it too. I mean, he's just chilling over here in the middle of this driveway or whatever. Let's sir, talk. Excuse me, sir. Are you... Whatever you're selling, I ain't buying. I ain't selling no, nothing, not dude. Selling any... A likely story. Name's Wendell. Joe Wendell. I like your nice mustache, you. dude. That <laughs> remains to be seen. Alright, what's that smell, dude? I don't want to alarm you, but there's a strange odor wafting from the back of your truck. I don't smell out. <laughs> really? Because it's like... Except the splendid scent of tasty mini Ks, the finest organic knack verse the Gap has to offer. Jesus Christ. Don't believe me? Look at those gang gangs. They love my knack verse. <laughs> Can't chase them away. <laughs> yeah, yep, yep. Okay. Anything about the stalker? Well, mate, today's your lucky day. This is a vehicle. Who would have thought? No, I'm looking for a special vehicle. But Brucey is special. Yeah, All he Brucey, needs huh? is his power cell and we'll be on our way. Okay. The vehicle I'm looking for had four legs and no wheels. A vehicle with legs? <laughs> Think you've got bats in your belfry, mate. Oh, I boy. I saw what I saw. It kidnapped a kid from my village. You're not the first I've heard talking about kids going missing in the gap. But I've never seen any come through here. All right. Thank you. Uh, so we need to find a power cell. Power cell has drained. Aye, emptier than a politician's vows. Wow. <laughs> there was a sandstorm put the bridge over yonder out of action. I was told to go park for a few hours. Turned into a few days. Oh, Trying to keep pieces. the mini case cool in this heat emptied the power cell. And now oh, they're all the going I bad. The margarita blender up in the cab. Oh, a working man needs his creature comforts. Oh, God. <laughs> anyway, 13.7 volts drained to nout. And they still haven't fixed that blooming bridge. Yeah, I like that and bridge fixed as well. Ever since? No choice until they send someone out to juice up Brucey's power. So cell. that's going to be our goal. Someone then. competent. I mean, have you spoken to Hobbsworth? Didn't I say someone competent? Yeah, he does not look that like he's doesn't know a competent. Rod from a Chapman strut. <laughs> all right, all right, let's I'll let's go, me. let's go. I'm fine with that. Shut up. Okay, so we need to recharge this guy, and then hopefully somehow find a way to bridge the bridge, bridge the gap. Maybe scare these boys away. And we don't have any like inventory items, but we've seen that girl somewhere over here. Uh, or there's a boy over here. Hello, sir. Oh, there's the girl. What is this? Roundabout? A sturdy chain tethered the roundabout to the ground. Merry-go-round roundabout. Okay. Hello, kid. Hey, kid. Hey, weird guy. Wow. Excuse me. Guy. I'm Pixel. It's easy to remember because it rhymes with pickle. So it does. Mm, Pixel. No That's horrible. I remember that easy because your name rhymes with fossil and you're old. Thanks, kid. <laughs> this kid, this kid knows. This kid's What's got his game on. It sucks. Stupid Mr. Hobsworth put a chain on it. I guess we need to he fix that as well. Safety. Then he dropped the chain on his foot. <laughs> yeah, he's not the smartest. He's not the smartest guy. I'm looking for a boy about your age named Milo, who may have come through here. You're asking the right guy. I remember every face that's come through here since I was a little kid. You're still a little kid. Yeah? How many is that? Like, at least 12. Holy shit, 12, How dude? We talking? That's crazy. Sometime over the past couple of nights. Oh, didn't know. Haven't seen no kids. Alright, you're useless, though. Bye. Call it if you need anything. Um, sure. Why do you have a chain around your neck? Can we do something with this chain? A chain tethered the roundabout to the ground. I wonder if you can... Nah, we can't use the crowbar. We're gonna need something else, but let's let's try it at least. What are you gonna do? Well, he's trying it. He's done it! Look at the man go! He can use his crowbar for everything. Push me! Alright, I'll push you. Go, dude. Are you, are you pushing? There you go. That's pulling, but that's also fine. He's got a he's got a helmet on, so safety, you know. 
All right, let's go talk to the girl over yonder. He seems happy. Okay, fine. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Uh, the dude's coming. He might not be happy about what we've done. There you go. All right. The kid's enjoying himself. Let's go talk to the lady. Sandpit. Sandpit. In the desert. <laughs> The irony sure wasn't lost on me. Sweet. Hello. I recognized the girl. She was the one who'd run away from me earlier. Stop running away from me. Excuse me. Hello? You! Me what? You're the guy in the desert. And you're I the mean, girl with the corpse. The desert is all okay, around. First of all, that guy was dead long before I got there. And second of all, it's your fault Big Steve stole my date. Lost your what? To who? Do you Big realize Steve? how much potential trade you cost me? Honestly, I have no idea what you're talking about. Ugh. I trade. I'm a trader. Name's Ember. Ember. Alright. What were you doing out there in the desert with that corpse? Mister, are you looking to trade something or what? Oh, shut up. Trade? Just asking question. Trade, you know, tech, gadgets, knickknacks from the gap or the city. That's what I do. I collect stuff, sell stuff. Trade stuff. Smart. Only, since you're interfering, let Big Steve fly off with my deed. It'll be a while before I can He's make proper trades again. Now, excuse the bird, me. isn't she? What's a deed? My deed, man. D T T. Data transfer tool. Deed. What's oh the deed for? Oh Duh, boy. transferring data. That's what I was doing. You know what? Kids are annoying. Transferring his. I'm gonna put it out there. Trading, yeah. She's annoying. You distracted me, and Big Steve nabbed At least off. the little guy like said, is happy thanks. now. But she's annoying. Okay. Uh, can we do something about Tell your deed? About this deed? Simple. I collect IDs and I use the deed to swap them. At least I did until Big Steve grabbed it. Who's Big, Big Steve's Steve? a bird, right? You see all these birds all over the place? Big Steve's the purple one with a beak full of my deed. <laughs> all right. <laughs> with the beak. Full of my D. Yeah, nice one. What were you doing out there in the desert with that corpse? I told you already. I was dating his ID. Mm -hmm. Only now, Big Steve has my okay, D. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Facto, Whatever. The ID. Uh, let's talk about the missing I kid, just maybe. I need to know if you've seen a missing. You're looking in the wrong place. Only boys around here are Pixel and Voxel, and the only thing they're missing is a few screws. Hey, Pixel is nice. Okay. All right, fine. That's all for now. Thanks. Anytime. She was no. Oh wait, no. She was no help. Come back if you want to talk business. Oh shut up, girl. For someone with a business interest in dead bodies, she seemed pretty normal. She seemed pretty annoying to me, not normal. There is a house up there. We need to get up there somehow. Emba. Grab its independent traders. Oh god. I bought from sketchier places out in the gap. <laughs> you sure? You just don't remember when, a right? Workbench had been set up. Can you use this? Structural integrity seemed over reliant on some old deflated tires. That seems fine. Tires are very sturdy. We cannot use the workbench. Go away, gang, gang. We cannot use the workbench. I was hoping maybe you could do something over here. I have seen the insides of you, my dude. That's, that's the worst. This is just a corner. How do we get up there? Hmm. It's a good question, isn't it? Is it up here? Is this where you climb up? Doesn't seem likely. Hmm. Seems, uh... Seems weird. Seems very strange. Don't know how to get up there, but that's fine. We'll learn more about this. Uh, old terminal. Let's examine that. I haven't seen one of these terminals in ten years. All right. Link, the evil behind everything that happened all those years ago. The attack on my village. The death what of my What do you mother. want? How can I be of assistance? By shutting up. Okay. Can we turn this on? Nothing happened. Probably not. Probably because the machine had had its innards ripped out. Could be. It looked like the sculpture had seen better days. Unless that was the intention. I have no idea what that's supposed to be. Okay. 
Waterfall. Sounds like electricity. There's something strange about the water. And there was an unmistakable smell of ozone. Up close, I could see the water was holographically concealing an electric fence. Oh. What what the hell? Oh, we have stepped inside. Yeah, there's an electric fence, but there's just stone behind it. Okay. Okay, please move. <laughs> Touch it. Yes. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Got zapped. Alright, I don't know what to do with this at all. I have no idea what's going on over here. And we have completed a full circle. Oh, that's Big Steve! Hey, Big Steve. One particularly large and familiar bird stood out from the rest. Get over here, Big Steve. It's probably gonna not gonna work if I do take tool, right? Oh, he stabbed on him. The bird's beak looked especially vicious. Okay, so he flew away, I'm guessing. Is that him? Seems like it's him. So we need to distract him somehow. Probably not to use a crowbar. Because we used crowbar on, ev on everything <laughs> so far. And it worked, but Big Steve just wants to fly around now. You coming down, buddy? Coming down? Maybe. It's flying ever lower, but also maybe not. Okay. So that's useless. I wonder if I can throw that soda at these gangans over here and that's gonna do anything. You guys want a soda? Cannot, we cannot use that, okay. We can use the crowbar. And that's the only thing. That's probably clearly weren't scared of me. Yeah. Or my crowbar. Clearly. Okay, let's go see. I think the big Steve has landed over there. Once again. Let's see if he wants a soda. We'll see if you can do that. Or maybe you can swap maybe you can swap for the Android uh, finger. We cannot use it. We cannot use the soda. Crowbar's probably not gonna work. Hey, give me that. These were tough desert birds. Are you waving a crowbar? Are you really terrified of this bird over here, dude? Jesus Christ. I thought you guys were descendants of Australians over here. I thought you were supposed to be tough motor truckers. So we need to find a way to get up there. It's probably gonna reveal more to us. Hmm. I do not know how though. Maybe that waterfall thing would help. But I don't think we can actually use anything on the waterfall. So that, that one's not gonna do it. Maybe maybe if I can give the trucker the soda, he's gonna help. Or maybe let's go talk to the weirdo over here. Maybe maybe we can talk more to him. Uh talk. Excuse me. Well, hi there, Str Well, I Subway. Right, I'll bet. And it's an old hope. By yeah, the yeah. Way, just so you know. Just stop talking, yes, dude. Of course, no problem. Uh, power cell. How are things going with Wendell's power cell? It's in my office. But how long until it's charged? Uh, it's hard to say, but it's on my list. Where is your office, though? May I ask? Any updates on? Not yet, but I'll get okay. onto it soon. Absorb. So what's your deep? All right. I am a diagnostician for the Ministry of Comfort. Sounds awesome. And what exactly does a diagnostician do? I find problems. And fix them? <laughs> uh, no, I just diagnose them. Minos fixes them. Oh, boy. All right, he's he's pretty useless. How about Tell Joey? About Joey. Praise Joey. Not a day goes by where I don't thank him for the happiness and prosperity. I don't see any prosperity see. around here, buddy. Joey and I go way back. We must be talking about the same one. Clearly. It depends. Our Joey was kind, benevolent. Okay, Does okay. That sound like hmm. My Joey was more of a sarcastic pain in the... But okay, he was my okay. best friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you around, huh? See you around, Hopeworth. Oh, I forget, Ooh. I really appreciate your patience back there when I was fixing the... Let me thank you properly. Uh, okay, he's okay. gonna do something. He's gonna do something for us, okay. What did he do? There you go. Your kudos just got a boost. Thanks. 
I think. Okay. Uh, that was the... Fast. We were like B minus, right? So that's like... Where do we see this? So the terminal? We gotta boost it up. Connect to minus. Right. And we had the C plus. Hmm, he did say it boosted us up, but we're, I think we're still C+. Plus. Hmm. You think we can use the bridge now? Probably not, right? Probably not. Error. Yeah. Insufficient permission. Thought so. Can we do anything else over here? We could give a drink to this guy. He seems parched. He's been out in the desert. And just sitting over here for a while. He would like a soda. I got your drink. Ah, look Shame at that. it ain't something stronger. Sorry, buddy. It's the only thing I got. Alright, well. Took it, I guess. So you can enjoy that. Let's go see if this uh, kudos update would get us maybe in here. Can we? No. no, no, no. It's fine. Where's that flying... Dirt bag. We can talk to him. Maybe, maybe he can answer more stuff to us now. Maybe. Okay, that's the birds. Can't really do much with birds. Where's the Where's the flyer? It was around here. There he is. Okay, hey, you get over here. How can I help? Talk to me. Excuse me. Yes. Greeting. Say that again. Registered Kaplan. Yes, Thanks. yes. Wasn't so hard, was it? Okay, now would you talk about okay. missing kid? I'm looking for a young Probably boy not, that's been right? Kidnapped. Don't worry, we'll find him. Is he a citizen? Oh god, no, please no. He's a Gaplander. Ah, well, unregistered Gaplanders cannot yeah, enter damn it. Union City. There's about that vehicle? Can you tell help. me more about it now? I need to find a vehicle. There are no personal vehicles in That's fine. No, it's one that I followed here from across the desert. It's got four giant metal legs. There are no such vehicles registered with Union City. Oh yeah? Right. It definitely came this way. Well, we're Kidnapped not completely sure it came this village. way, because it could have gone around. Only Union City citizens can file missing persons reports. Alright, bye. You're not now. you're not useful. It was great meeting you. You were not useful. You know what? I wonder, since we have a new update on our thingy, I wonder maybe we can touch this waterfall and it's gonna go away or something like that. Get into his personal office. Maybe it's here. I don't know where else it would be. Please. Please stop. Stop running into this thing. Let me move. Electric fence. Touch. Nope. We're gonna work. I really don't know why this electric fence is here, but okay. Okay, well, I tried. Anyway, that's the beauty of adventure games, you know? You run around, you try stuff out, and finally, when things click, you get the idea of what's going on, and it's awesome. But, as I said, it's not exactly the perfect thing for YouTube, so... I gave you a preview of how the game works and operates, and probably if I played more, I would spoil it for you if you guys wanted to play it yourself. So, this is where we're gonna chill. I'm just gonna check how much is it on Steam right now. It is currently 20% off until 23rd of July, which means it only costs 23.99 euros right now. So that is pretty good for the game of the caliber, I'd say. It's not too expensive, it's quite nice. And even if you don't wanna buy it, put it in your wish list, it's gonna help the devs. And otherwise, you know, just grab it and I think if you like adventure games, I think this has the potential to, I don't know, I'm not gonna say revitalize the genre, but at least, at least maybe get some new people playing it, because it's fun. But for now, thank you everybody for watching, hope you enjoyed it, I'll see you guys next time. Kirk out.